Mary and Martha. The village was very quiet that day. Nothing was stirring. A small dog sat watching the women of the village. As usual, they were getting on with the household jobs. Martha and Mary were two sisters, and like the other women, they were busy at home. Suddenly, there was a noise. They looked up from their work. I wonder what it is, asked Martha. I don't know, answered Mary. Shall I go and find out? She went away to look. She was away for a short while, and then she returned, and she was very excited. Martha, Martha, she cried, you will never guess. It's Jesus and his friends. They have come to our village. Isn't that amazing? I wonder what he'll be talking about. I've heard so much about him. Oh, that's fantastic, replied Martha. Let's invite him to our house for a meal. And so... They did. Martha was thrilled, but she was also worried and anxious. Oh, there's so much work to be done before they arrive, she thought. There's cleaning and cooking. There's water to fetch and boil. There's bread to make. And oh, the list just goes on. First of all, she put on her apron. She needed to keep clean. She picked up her broom and she began to sweep the floor. The floor was very dusty and Martha found that it was very tiring. Once it was all tidy, she went and put the broom away. Now it's time to head to the well, she thought. I need much more water so Jesus and his friends can wash. It was hard work and the water vessel was so very heavy. Once she had the water, Martha went to fetch the table. It was also very heavy, but she dragged it into place. Next, she prepared the bread, kneading it and baking it. Once it was cooked, Martha then decided to set the table. She would have to put everything in its place for her guests. There were dishes to put out and bowls and spoons and plates to lie right across the table. Then she thought, I'd better go and get the kettle so I can boil the water. Again, the kettle was very heavy and she went and got it. Oh, now she would have the rest of the food to prepare. Oh, she needed help. Where was Mary? Martha went to look for her sister. Mary was with Jesus, of course. She was sitting on the ground by his feet. All Mary wanted to do was listen to Jesus. Martha was not happy at all. She said, Jesus, don't you care that my sister has left me to do all the work by myself? Tell her to come and help me. Jesus answered her, Martha, Martha, you are worried and troubled over so many things, but only one thing is really important, and Mary's got it right. What do you think Martha did then? I think she probably realised that Jesus was right. The right thing to do was to spend the precious time that Jesus was there to sit at his feet and listen to him. And you know, it's the same for us as well. The end.